Hello everyone, I'm Shanice and welcome to my channel if you are new. Before I begin, please hit that subscribe button. I'm on the road to 5k subs and I would appreciate it if you join me on that journey. Uh, this episode is titled The Tide of Bone. Previously, uh, Percy's sister was on the verge of death or maybe she did die. And Keyleth brought her back to life. Percy got his revenge and the first person or technically the second person is off his list Anders so um Delilah Briarwood Briar resurrected or brought back a lot of undead people and now it's the group versus the undead so without further ado let's get into this episode of Vox Machina <laughs> is that Silas? she turned him into a vampire? Hold on. <laughs> Don't read from the book! <laughs> Woo! That's some Freddy Krueger type stuff. Feel better. Different. <laughs> Trust in the whispered one, for we are his blood. What did you do, my dear? Wow. He's not mad at her for um changing him. Conversation if you're in a relationship, I want you to have a conversation like if I was lying on my deathbed, would you try to bring me back to life or would you want me would you let me go? It's so hard to let go though. We may want to get out of here. Uh, aren't these things supposed to be slow? No. Come on, let's move. Thanks, Kiki. Yeah. That's where all dead people live. <laughs> oh. 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 Father, you made it. I, I assumed, since you're the rightful heir... Titles don't matter anymore. You're the leader, Archibald. Yeah, in that situation... Zombies always eat the little guy first. They know how delectable I am. Ugh. So cool. Dead, yes. In fact, we make a pretty good team. <laughs> uh, I'm rooting for a Vax. Vaxlith? Wait. He. Wait, I don't know how to mesh their names together. <laughs> well, they weren't really important. Even though there's, the lives are important. We didn't know them. They're losing heart, Percy. Say something to them. I can't. Julius was supposed to rule, not me. Julius is gone. And I've been with the Briarwoods for years. No one trusts me. Oh, I'm no oh, Pike. This is way beyond me. Necrosis. You'll lose the arm within the hour. What? The hour? What? No, no, I need this arm for, like, stuff. And Caleb, you just brought somebody back from the brink of death or death. How you not know how to heal? Like, Cassandra's throat was cut open and you healed it. So what's the difference between that and Scanlan's arm? Oh, shoot. 
the bag. Got the blade ready. Bah, bah. Ooh. Holy shit! <laughs> Do that again. She could. Sadly, it's still a work in progress. Amir would be ordered to fight alongside the Rulu if you only tell them. Unlikely. Tell them what? You want to talk? So fast. That happened so fast. I'm like, why are they just standing there like that? Oh my god. We just rescued Archie. Come on. Everyone stay back. <gasps> oh, she's an airbender too. Wait, is that it? No, that's like um anymore. she like sub zero. Yes, Keila. Wow. Have I mentioned you're amazing? Yes, yes. Just kiss already. I want them to kiss. Do it. <laughs> That's been like my phrase this whole series. Do it. Like Palpatine, do it. R.I.P. to Archie, though. Oh, Scanlan's arm. Archie didn't make it. Yours wasn't the only life shattered that day. We're all here. The time is now. No one else can do this. I am Lord Percival Frederick Steinbaum Musil Kolowski the Ruler the Third. <laughs> that was a lot. On the day the like Dumbledore's name or something. The day is for Archie. For the Dorolos! For Whitestone! Yeah! Yeah! For Whitestone! Let's kill fucking everything! They just bonk. To be honest, I wouldn't even really be that scared. They're literally skeletons. Ew, his arm got holes in it. I can't look. That's triggering my um. It's a phobia, type of phobia. You, uh, you know I'm in love with you, right? <laughs> Wait, what? Now? I mean, this is like the worst, worst time. Yep. <laughs> why? Do, why do people do that? They wait till they're like, they could die to confess their feelings. Pike! Pike is back! Oh! This is like Captain Marvel in Endgame. Pike! Let it be Pike. It has to be Pike. Your ass what? I'm here, buddy, but the <laughs> body is back at the temple. We got the whole group back. <laughs> His jaw dropped. <laughs> Whoa! Damn, she's OP. This has gotten out of hand. I'm going to the front. And risk everything? You're too valuable. They've left us no choice. She sounds like a Zula. Like, I, I remember thinking that in like a few episodes ago, but it's coming back to me now. She sounds like a Zula. The legend's back! 
To get jumped. Get off me, you fucking Get out of Damn. Oh, he dying slow. Ooh. May your weapons strike with the divine virtue of the Everlight. Well, fearless leader, need. Ew. Our hidden tunnel. It was good enough to hide from that. Secret tunnel. Secret tunnel. <laughs> Cass, I'm so sorry. I wish I could go back and do things differently. I know. Did I hear you say you were looking for the Briarwoods? Are you friend or foe? Foe. If you free me. Is that another person on Percy's hit list? No! This is the only freedom I offer you. Who's he with? Ah! Oh my gosh! They never ended the episode like that. Oh, damn. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I don't want to know. I don't want to know. Okay. Damn, Amazon be so quick to hop into the next episode. Oh my goodness, amazing episode. That may be like top three. It was giving me Avengers Endgame, uh, The Long Night from Game of Thrones in Season 8, even though we can all agree Season 8 wasn't the best. Some Walking Dead, Resident Evil type of vibes. Oh my goodness, I'm so happy. I mean, I kind of knew that Pike was going to choose the path of like being with her friends. Because that's, I guess, like, that's her true self. Like, even though, yeah, what they're doing may seem, like, unholy. Hold on one moment. My camera's going to cut off. Um, She's still, like, herself. She's more free in that way than if she were to stick with just her um, community of people who follow the Everlight with that group. She wouldn't be all that happy. So... I'm glad that the Everlight was like, okay, boom, not only am I going to, like, bring you back or give you the Everlight back, it's going to be on 10. She did the whole superhero landing. She, it also, like, Naruto in the war arc, she powered all of their weapons. Like, Naruto, when he touched everybody and gave them a piece of the nine tail chakra. See? I'm like, Because ah. there was a time where, like, I didn't know anything about Naruto. Now I know Naruto. But um, it was giving me that um, vibes. And I found it funny when Scanlan was like, marry me. And she was like, all right, let's do it. And then with Vax and Keyleth, how come it took him on the verge of like dying or being close to death to reveal that he, uh, he said the love word. So I agree with her. Like, you're telling me now, like, we could die, both of us, or one of us, and now you want to confess your feelings for me? I hate when people do that in movies, and that tends to happen in real life, too. So if there's someone that you've been with, tell them that you love them, because you never know tomorrow's not promised. Shoot, today, like, the ending of today is not even promised. You never know what could happen, but um, tell your loved ones that you love them. Love them. I like that little moment between Vex and uh, Percy, when she was telling him, oh, go ahead and lead or something. And he kind of looked at her. I'm telling you, at the end of this, they're probably going to come together. Because they're practically like the same in a way. And then Grog with his usual self. Uh, the Duke has been defeated. Um, I thought Scanlan would be the one to do it. But I guess it makes sense that the people 
were the ones to like defeat the Duke and uh we still don't quite know what Delilah and Silas's plans are and I'm glad that we got to kind of see like the origin story of Silas and Delilah like she was always practicing like spells and whatnot and Silas was dying of some sort of disease but she was able to bring him back and she brought him back as a vampire. I don't know if it's because she drew blood or blood was incorporated into the spell and that's why he's a vampire or I don't know but yeah without oh I was gonna say without further ado let's get into the episode wow thank you guys so much for watching my video all the way up to this point if you did please give it a thumbs up subscribe down below again 5k let's go let's get it I'm like ugh, I'm like hungry for it I'm about to dang I kinda acted like Rob just now <laughs> I'm so sorry. And you will see me in the next video. Bye, guys.